Warning, no trespassing at National Limestone Quarry. Access is only granted to insured rock club field trips. Check out the Central PA Rock and Mineral Club, the Friends of Mineralogy PA, or many other great local rock clubs to learn more. Dirt Man here with Bill Stevens of the Friends of Mineralogy, Pennsylvania, at the wonderful Upper Wavelight Pit at the National Limestone Quarry in Mount Pleasant Mills in Snyder County, Pennsylvania. Digging Wavelight. And it's going to be a beautiful day, blue skies, and we've got a special guest with us. Where's John? John, say hi. Hi. John, the geologist who's mined with both of us at Mohawk Mo Mo Valley Mineral Mining yes. in New York. He's here. Campus. He's ready to hit some wave light too. Yes. And we're here with the rest of the crew. Say hi, everybody. Woo! Woo! All right. Fellas, can you let us have a little peek at some of that wave of light? <laughs> oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. Look at that wave of light right there. And we're right on the border. This is a fault right here. And there's fossils all over there where that gentleman over there is collecting. Wave of light's a phosphate, and it fills in fractures and voids in the Ridgely member of the old port formation. Lower Devonian in age and resting on the south flank of an anticline where we have the Tamalaway and Kaiser formations being quarried for road aggregate. And that's all I gotta say about that. We're gonna be getting into this rock here. We're gonna be getting into this face. So we're gonna be pulling out Underneath some good those? stuff here. <laughs> there you go. Look at that. That's a lot of work. <laughs> was it worth that it? That is awesome. Was that worth it? it? That is oh, awesome. Yeah. That's the best damn one so far. There you go. That is so cool. Huh? Nice. That's what you're capable of pulling out here. Pockets filled with green balls. So I stepped away from the ledge for a second and walked straight up on the biggest fossils I've seen in this pit yet. Now, this side of the, the fault is the wave light, and that side is actually the fossils. These must have rolled down the hill here. Check these out. Look how big those bracks are sticking out of this rock. That is awesome. I just came across another rock that I believe has a gastropod in it, but I've got to break it out of the rock. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, it's a gastropod. That's a big gastropod too. Holy Christmas. Let's see if we can get this all the way out. There it is. Wow. It's loose, it's about to come out too. Oh. There it is. Wow. That's cool, and it came out of the rock. Try doing that with a Herkimer diamond, it's gonna bust every time. This was the first wave of light pit opened up here at Mount Pleasant Mills. It's kinda tapped out at this point, but there's always new stuff that you can find, like this boulder here, covered with wave of light. However, their average size is usually smaller than that found in the new pit, where everyone is hard at work trying to hit the bigger specimens. All right, this guy just came across this sitting on the ground. Look at that green. It's coming out. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Great job, man. All right, John has just pulled out some nice size wave light balls. These, I don't know what we call these, half inch. That is pretty nice. Yep, lemon balls. They're fantastic. They are really, really good. Yeah, that's what I was really wanting $300 today. Piece. I'm Dermann. I'm Bill Stevens. I'm Geologist John. Bringing the geology to you from here at Mount Pleasant Mills in Snyder County, Pennsylvania. Back to you, Jerry. <laughs>